Facts First presents Mom shares a simple home remedy for ear infections and it goes viral. Children go to school every day with hundreds of other children. When it comes to keeping from getting sick, kids just don't really care. They don't wash their hands after opening and closing the bathroom door. They don't cover their mouths when they sneeze or cough. And that means your child is going to get sick a few times during the year. And when your child comes home sick, they bring the virus home to you. Well, soon the entire family is sick, including you, and it can be frustrating, but it happens quite often. It's just part of being a parent. Kids often get sick because of the germs in the school, and it can happen at the most inconvenient times. Your child, though, I mean, they can get sick the night before you leave for vacation, or the illness can kick in while you're driving, resulting in vomit all over your car. As inconvenient and sometimes disgusting as a sick child can be, it's more heartbreaking than anything. Seeing your child, if you're a parent, if you see your child in pain, that's just one of the worst things about being a parent. Anybody who's ever had an earache, you know how painful they can be. An earache can make swallowing difficult, and the pain can make sleeping practically impossible. Many people will take over-the-counter pain relief when they have an earache. Unfortunately, it can take time for that pain medication to kick in. Well, there's a woman who's figured out a great remedy for earaches, and it has since gone viral after she shared it online. The remedy was actually passed down from her great aunt, and the family secret was passed down so often because it actually worked. I'll tell you what that remedy is in just a moment. First, help us spread the word about Facts First by clicking that like button. Also, be sure to subscribe and click the notification bell so you don't miss our future videos. Parents have been using two earache remedies for years. Some parents have their child lie on a heating pad with the painful ear on the pad. Some parents have their child lie down on a hot water bottle. And there are many parents who will shove cotton balls into their children's ears, thinking that it eases the pain. In most cases, these remedies don't really do much. But a mother named Echo Featherstone has a remedy that actually works. Echo's remedy is pretty simple. First, you take a cloth and wet it with very hot water. When the cloth is soaked, you wring it out, and next, you put the wet cloth in a mug and then cook it in the microwave for about 20 seconds. The mug should be warm and the cloth should be burning hot. Now, place the open end of the mug over your child's ear. Just make sure that the hot cloth doesn't come into contact with your child's ear. According to Echo, the pressure from this mug will relieve the buildup pressure in the ear. This will cause the pain to subside. And apparently, this remedy really works. That's why it's gained so much attention. When Echo's son got an earache, she took a photo of him using her home remedy. She wrote the secret was given to her mother from her Aunt Mare. She also included the home remedy for her friends and family members to try. She never expected this post to go viral. She was just sharing it with a few friends and family. She was shocked when this Facebook post was shared over 261,000 times. It was also liked over 57,000 times. Parents all over the world were liking and sharing her posts. Many of the comments were from parents thanking Echo for her home remedy. Many said that it really worked, too. She had to turn off her notifications the day after creating the post because her phone was just exploding with notifications. She had no idea so many people were going to be sharing that post. Echo made sure to let her Facebook friends know that it can take up to 30 minutes for her home remedy to actually work. She says that her mother used it on her for years, and she was prone to frequent earaches. Echo made sure the parents knew that her home remedy wasn't a cure. If a child has an ear infection, they're still going to need antibiotics to treat the condition. Her natural remedy is simply to ease the pain for a while before a child can get to the doctor. So the next time your child is complaining of an earache, try Echo's natural remedy. It won't work right away, but if you can get your child to try the remedy for half an hour, it can be effective. You never know, it could work. And the sooner your child starts to feel better, the sooner you will start to feel better too. Does your family have any medical remedies like this that you'd like to share? Tell us in the comments below and subscribe for more.